Hey everyone, my name is Olaf, and today I'll teach you how you can quickly add background images in Blender 2.8. As always, it's going to be quick and easy, so uh, let's get started. Okay, so let's start off by deleting the default cube, so press X to delete the default cube, then go into the world settings, and then environment texture, then open, and you can download these background images in the link below. I'm going to use the Chelsea stairs. And then open the HDR file in Blender. And when we go into rendered view, you can see that we have the background image. So uh, let's add some objects and uh, see what it looks like when we have some material. So press S to scale. And then let's add a uh, Suzanne monkey. So add, mesh, and then let's add a monkey. Then press G, and then set to grab the object on the z-axis and then S to scale. And uh, let's add a, a subdivision surface modifier. Increase the number of subdivisions and then apply the modifier. And let's add smooth shading as well under object. And then press G, then set to grab the monkey on the z-axis. And uh, then let's go into rendered view and add a material for the monkey. Let's add a, a glossy shader. Decrease the roughness. And uh, let's give it an orange color. And as you can see, we can see the background image in the material as a uh, reflection. And then let's uh, add a gloss material to the uh, floor as well. And when we decrease the roughness, once again, we can see the background image in the material, which looks great. The next step is to set up the light. So select the um, light source. Let's change it into a sun then set the strength to 15, and then press R, then set to rotate the sun on the z-axis. And then let's set up the camera, so press number zero to look through the camera, and press N, go to view, and then lock the camera to view. You can also hide the overlay to hide the grid, and then let's render the scene. So go to render, and then render image. And as you can see, we have the render with the background image. And that's it for this tutorial, I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll post more Planet 2.8 tutorials very soon. So thank you guys for watching, and subscribe.